What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and I am back after three weeks of kind of going MIA, but not really, I was just simply trying to get through this semester of school, but I'm finished finally, finals are over, and yeah, I have a lot of free time on my hands to start posting content for you guys, um, but I've been getting asked quite a bit of questions over on Twitter and with some of my friends, they want to know if I'm still playing Call of Duty Modern Warfare, and unfortunately that answer is no, I have not been playing as much as I would like to and I think I'm only like level 40 which is really really depressing for me to see because usually around this time I would be closing in around third prestige but I simply just do not have any desire or motivation to play but Activision has been actually sending out surveys to people asking what could bring them back to play Modern Warfare so today I want to discuss this with you guys and so much more. Now, granted, Modern Warfare does have a lot of core features that makes the game very revolutionary for the Call of Duty franchise, such as crossplay. Never ever in a million years would I have thought that would come to Call of Duty. Um, free DLC maps, content, um, a battle pass that's actually the best post-launch content system in COD ever. Um, there's a few more things I can list off, but basically this game has amazing core features, but the game itself sucks, and I'm not afraid to say that. This is probably the least favorite Call of Duty game in my opinion and if I could I definitely would go back to play another year of Black Ops 4 but really I don't want this video to seem like it's a hate Modern Warfare video this game's trash because of this this and this whatever instead I'm hoping I can provide the community with better feedback and use what little voice I may have to express what needs to be done in order for myself and many others to go back and play your game so Activision did the right thing though because they have been sending out this email on screen for you guys to a couple players who have kind of gone inactive from Modern Warfare. I have not yet received one. I'm sure that I would be in that population though because I haven't touched the game in, in quite a few um, weeks now and I mean I may have played like a few games here and there with some friends but I don't think the most games that I passed was like maybe five. Um, but anyways I think I do fall in that little population there. Um, anyways though the survey is going to be on screen and these are a few things that Activision asked that would convince you to start are playing Modern Warfare again and some of this stuff includes new in-game content such as maps, modes, um, new in-game events and challenges, um, stuff that has to do with spec ops, um, some cross-play issues and technical work, that kind of stuff. But to be honest, like this is all those kind of core features of what sums up Modern Warfare, which is perfect, but the game itself, like the spawns, the terrible skill-based matchmaking, um, that stuff like that is what's ruining this game it's not the core features it's the actual game itself and infinity ward has done a better job though of um replying to feedback and responding over on reddit and coming out with updates here and there but still there's quite a few things that are constantly plaguing the game like the terrible skill-based matchmaking how camping is glorified the spawns etc the small details of the game are what makes this game entirely egregious and again that's depressing for me to say because this game is only only been out for two months now and I think the last time I actually sat down and played for hours like I actually said hey I'm gonna play Modern Warfare like all day was on the launch weekend so all this revolutionary graphics and sound design crossplay free DLC etc all of these amazing core features do not stand out as much as they should be because of the gameplay itself being completely trash um, for example footsteps are ridiculously loud even though they have been nerfed quite a bit it's still very very loud which itself promotes camping um dead silence that should be a perk uh, ghost before you have to be moving in order for you to not show up on the enemy's minimap but now you don't even have to be moving to show up on there you can literally sit in a corner and you will not show up on the minimap when a uav is up so um the map design themselves do promote camping and it's just very very frustrating because there is so much potential that this game could have had and i feel the main issue that needs to be addressed to get players back to playing the game often and frequently again is if you make the game just friendlier to all types of players not just the casuals and I think if skill based matchmaking was turned down substantially to the point where it does not punish players who've gone on a string of good games 
then that alone would bring back and satisfy a good majority of the player base, both active and inactive, in fact, and just be straight up honest and transparent with how skill-based matchmaking actually works in Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Um, skill-based matchmaking is probably the main complaint in this game so far, and I feel even if they were to just address this in like an update or over on Reddit and just be clear with us and concise with us about how it works, then that could definitely satisfy a lot of players. But if you want to have a heavy skill-based matchmaking system where you want to match up the best of the best players against each other, then just add a ranked playlist. I cannot believe that Modern Warfare still doesn't have a competitive playlist when this game is going to have a freaking franchise Call of Duty League coming next year. That just perplexes me beyond a belief. Um, keep skill-based matchmaking in there and leave the regular playlist alone. Also, I feel that the minimap should be reverted back to how it used to be in every Call of Duty game. That's obviously the popular opinion in the game there. So I just wish Infinity Ward would just listen to that. Um, map voting too is another option that was on the survey. I feel that should definitely be added to Modern Warfare. These are just a few things that I would like to see added to Modern Warfare, but they're just not my own personal opinions. This is what everyone and a majority of the fan base wants. I'm still probably going to be posting content on this game though given that I do have about a month break here but I just do not see myself playing this game anywhere past maybe 10 hours a week unless maybe that leak battle royale content comes out then you'll probably catch me on there quite a bit but as for the regular multiplayer playlist I just do not have any desire to play because of these issues that are hindering the game from its crazy potential um, but I do got to give props to Activision for sending out that survey all I can say is I really do hope you listen to the feedback and just make the right decision for some of these issues because it could definitely bring back a lot of players it could save your game it's still you know pretty early to do so but you gotta act now and definitely sending out that survey is the right move so uh, props to you guys for there I'm sorry for going on the big hiatus guys I promise I'm gonna be posting more frequently now definitely go ahead and follow me on Twitter if you guys want to keep up to date with the latest Call of Duty Modern Warfare news and tips that kind of stuff and when I post videos and just check up what I'm doing because I've been hectically busy these past couple of months now um, but again I'm back now I have nothing to do for the next couple of weeks here my fingers crossed that this game does get better I really really do want to like this game and play it but it's just so frustrating after a couple games and I don't even want to dare touch this game solo but please tell me what you guys think about this down below in the comments do you guys actually like modern warfare and if so please tell me what you like but if there are some things that you would like to be changed then leave them down below in the comments as well um, if you are one of those inactive players if you fall under that spectrum like me then just please tell me down below what you guys would like to see fix and change in order for you to come back to playing this game as often as um, you have been in the past before so thanks so much for watching guys love y'all so so much till next time i'll see you guys later